Gotta get to the RPGs. Where would they be? Oh, the towers. There's gotta be the towers. That's right. Keep moving. Speech? Moving against other camps? Jesus, that's harsh. Come on, you son of a bitch. Yeah, right. I'll do it. I gotta get this Sarah. Sarah, uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, come in. Damn it. Hang on, I'm coming. Can't you stand guard or do whatever it is you're doing out there? Colonel's orders. Gotta keep eyes on you at all times. Yeah, well, fuck the Colonel's orders. Hey, you watch your mouth. Things are changing around here. And if you don't follow the order... <laughs> Make sure we're clear. You're good. You're clear. Okay. That's the plan. I need you to pack your stuff. We're leaving. How are we gonna get out of here? There are guards everywhere. Do you trust me? O'Brien. I'm here. We're heading up to the cone. We got one shot at this. Copy that. O'Brien out. Who's O'Brien? Where are we going? Look, I don't have time to explain. You got everything? We're not coming back. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Right, stay close, and if we see anyone... Hey. In case you didn't read my note. Wait, so who's O'Brien? How's he getting us out of here? I told you, O'Brien is how I found you. He was the Nero soldier who was there that night, the night that I put you on that chopper. Nero? Oh, shit, Weaver! No, 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 that one. The canister. Right. Private! Are you paying attention? Eyes on your work, man! That canister, right there! Up! I don't want to see that canister fall. Holy shit, he let us go. Weaver let us go. Oh shit, more guards. Okay, hold here. Come on, let's go around them. Okay. So, Brian, the guy in the Nero chopper, he's coming here? Yeah, look, it's a long story. I'll tell you all about it once we get clear. Wait, so they're still flying? I mean, God, Deacon, they must have resources, labs, equipment. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure they do. Look, you can ask O'Brien when you see him. Another guard. Hold on, I'll distract him. Yeah, I'll be careful. Soldier, what are you doing? Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. This area is off limits. How dare you talk back to an officer? Do you know the penalty for disrespect? Hey, uh, <laughs> well done. Another guard. I'll see if I can get them to move. Yeah, I'll be careful. Well done. Come on. We're almost there. I can't wait to see Boozer again. You, uh, you want to go with me? To Lost Lake, I mean? I mean, I, th I thought we were going to Cloverdale. No, we are. I mean, I just want to see him. He's like my big brother. I don't know. It's not like we have much family left these days, you know? Wait. I'll distract him. This is restricted. Are you questioning me, soldier? Hey, what? Uh. <laughs> nice one. Couldn't have done it without you. I can see daylight. Come on, we're almost out. Yeah, okay, this is it. We're at the cone.
Okay. We made it. Where's it? Where is he? Where's O'Brien? Oh, gentlemen, this is the top of the cone where you can see we get an amazing view here. Oh, Lieutenant. I've just been giving this group of new recruits a tour of the island. Oh, we're just about to go down into the Ark. You should join us. Uh, well, uh, gentlemen, Colonel... this is Lieutenant Whitaker. She heads up part of the research team that's exploring ways to use poison to defeat our enemies. Traitor! Wait! 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 Don't we listen to going her. On a He's a murderer run. and a spy. Why would you, Do you listen to him camp over I told me? You, about? you know I am not. Like the leader of that camp, Lost Lake, oh, sent him here. Full of I'm shit. telling I, you. I've never even met this motherfucker. Colonel, you've got to believe me. Enough! All right. I'm listening. I am telling you, he is a spy. Matt, this mm -hmm. guy's crazy. You've never seen him before. Yeah. Lieutenant, he comes out of nowhere. Are you going to believe him? What's that camp you're saying I'm from? You think I'm lying? Is that it? I'm not lying. Have him show us your back. Yeah. Huh? Show us enough, your back. Enough, enough! That's my last warning. Now we will get to the truth of this matter. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. Captain Khoury, I forget, is that the 8th or the 9th commandment? I don't rightly recall, sir. Tell me what you saw, and don't lie to me, son. I'll know. At Lost Lake Camp, he attacked a woman. What the fuck are Barbara! you talking? He wasn't wearing a shirt. Son of a bitch has a tattoo covering his back. It's some satanic shit. It's some kind of dog, a dead dog chewing through a chain or something, like it was nothing. I, I pulled him off her. He was drunk, and we fought like hell, but who knows what wouldn't have happened if I hadn't have been there. You make him show us his back, and you will see who's lying. I'm sorry, Colonel. This shit is just so crazy. <clears throat> Turn it. <clears throat> you wear the image of Cerberus, the Hound of Hades. How fitting that you were discovered ascending from the underworld. But you are not Cerberus, are you? Deacon St. John. He's lying. You hide behind angelic names of the truth and clothe yourself in lies! He got kicked out you of You are Judas! Of the and what about you, Lieutenant? How convenient that you were with the Drifter when the Nero helicopter came by. Colonel, I do not know what you're talking about. You were in a Nero camp that was overrun. How long have you been spying on us? How long? Matt, I promise, I haven't been- More lies! I expect this from drifters. I expect men like him to betray me! What did the officer- Colonel! It was me! Uh, it was me! But Colonel, I lied. If you look in my pocket, you're gonna find a radio. Because I called them. I called them and I lied. I lied to the lieutenant. I told her that uh, I needed her to help me check shipment, but the truth is I just needed a hostage. Deacon St. John, Drifter, are you there? This is Nero, this is O'Brien, Drifter. I'm sorry. Corporal St. John is unavailable right now. Wait. Who is this? Sometimes, in the search for truth, the blood of innocence is spilled. I'm sorry, my dear. Release Private uh, Sarkovsky, was it? Yeah. And Kuri. 
Take this drifter to lock up. Tomorrow at 0700, he will stand trial. And he will hang. Lieutenant, enough of this. We have work to do. Come. Tell me more about this Lost Lake camp. Yes, sir. Anything you want to know. Lieutenant! Please. Come on. Get up. Uh. Good. I thought I heard you breathing. Oh, fuck you. That's what I want to hear. It means the shit hadn't broken you yet. <clears throat> okay. Why? Tat on your back. A dead dog chewing through its chains? <clears throat> Not something you see every day. <clears throat> I did some digging before we freed you. I was, um, I don't know, trying to make sense out of it. This was taken from the lieutenant when she came into the camp. My guess is, it's yours. Yeah, it's mine. And your wife's name? It ain't Beth. No, it ain't. And you've been out here all this time? Trying to find her? Yeah. You just asked me why. <laughs> Pretty simple, really. The way I figure it, any man who goes through God knows what to find his old lady does not deserve to die at the end of a rope. Wait, wait, wait a second. You're, you're, you're helping me? Well, that, that just means you're all gonna hang. We're not going back. The colonel is batshit crazy. <laughs> Holy war, genocide, I mean, what the fuck is that? Yeah, well then, what's the plan? What are you gonna do? We're going east. Yeah. Hopefully we can make it to Reno. You should come with us. Nope. Well, you can't go back. The militia will shoot no, you on I'm sight. No, I'm not leaving without her. Uh, and I gotta ride north. I gotta warn Iron Mike. It's way too late for that now. <laughs> Why? Well, they spent all night clearing the Santiam Pass. What? A convoy rode out early this morning heading north. Oh, shit. You sure you don't want to come with us? Yeah, I'm sure. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Hey, uh, uh, Corey. When I told the Colonel about my military service, I told him I hated every goddamn minute of it, but, uh, maybe it wouldn't have been so bad if... I'd served under someone like you. You know, maybe it's not too late. Getting low on ammo. Gotta get back to Lost Lake. I gotta head north. I gotta save Boozer. Ricky. Uh, Mike. I, I can't save Sarah. I can't save Sarah, but I can save them. 
sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I am not giving up. I'm going to come back for you, I swear to God. I am coming back for you. Now get to head north. Take the, uh, Sandium Highway. It's clear now. Yeah, that's fast. use this. Them, huh? Where'd you all go? Yeah.
Hang on, Lucia. I'm coming.
of us have been looking for him. No one's seen him. Hey, don't worry. We're gonna find that asshole. Oh, Deke, thank God. Come on. Ricky, what's going on? It's Iron Mike. He got shot. Hey, you lazy son of a bitch. I wanted to... See if you wanted to go fishing. We got a camp to feed. <coughs> you found her? You found her? You're a lady. Yeah, Mike, she's right outside. She's here. Yeah. Yeah, look, I uh, couldn't have done this without your help. No easy way to say this. Iron Mike's dead. He stopped. He tried to stop Schizo when the militia were pulling out. Iron Mike being Iron Mike. He tried to reason with him and. Okay. Yeah, I... shut up! Shut up! This ain't no eulogy. Iron Mike wouldn't want that. I don't have time for this because. Because the men that we killed today. Well, there's more where that came from. A lot more. I've been to their camp. I've seen their army. And when they come back here, they're gonna slaughter each and every one. 
Who's he going to try? Unless we hit them first. Hey! Hey, shut up! Shut up! Listen to him. Iron Mike trusted him, so you have to trust him! No, 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 I'm sorry. You know what? I can't do this. I'm not Iron Mike. I'm a goddamn drift. You're right. There's a road. No, I'm not fucking leaving. Look at me. Listen. All right. If I'm Boozer, tell me maybe like Kevin. Okay, so I found this in a survivalist bunker. Wait, this is... Yeah, yeah, we're gonna need a truck. Something big, something like a dub truck. And we're gonna fill it full of uh, fertilizer. nitrate? Yep. We're gonna mix it with 100 gallons of creosote. A fertilizer truck bomb. That's your plan. Oh, my God. The militia have turned this entire island into a fortress. I got civilians in the caves. You got the labor force and those considered unfit to serve in this survivor camp. And you got the armory and the garrison right by the main gate. We hit that. We tear out the heart of the colonel's militia. What about Sarah? Well, I mean, she's in the caves. It's what the colonel calls the Ark. But how, how do you know that they're not just going to kill everybody? Sarah, Sarah and everyone else. I, I don't, I don't, but I figure that the explosion will cause so much confusion and chaos that they're, I can go in, I can find her, I can get her out before they know what hit her. Look, this isn't about just Sarah anymore. The colonel has declared war on all of us, and he's got an army to back him up. Just the first casualties in that war. And <laughs> it's gonna be a short one unless we hit them first. <sighs> I didn't say it was a good plan. No, it's a really shitty one, Nate. You with me, brother? Oh, I wouldn't miss it. Okay. Well, we're not gonna be able to do it alone. If anyone wants to join in, you hit them, you hit them at the south gate. Mm -hmm. Because when the explosion happens, all the militia, they're gonna rush up toward the main gate. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna need some supplies. Crazy asses. <sighs> Folks here in a lot of pain, 